Kissing bugs are pretty elusive. They're nocturnal, and so they tend to come out and be active and feed on blood during the night. They're called kissing bugs because they were initially thought to bite only around the mouth. Why bugs? For me, it's because they carry disease, so they're the vector of this little parasite called Trypanosoma cruzi. And that parasite, if it infects a human or a dog or maybe some other animals, we're not quite sure, but in humans and dogs, we know that that parasite can cause a disease called Chagas disease. And since I'm interested in studying that disease, I should also study the bug that can transmit it from one animal to another animal or a human. Dry ice emits CO2 as it gets closer to room temperature. Kissing bugs, mosquitoes, um, they're attracted to it because we emit CO2. And so um, basically we're hoping that they'll come to this. We've never used this method before. This is a typical Saturday night for you two. <laughs> he's, he's been on more bug collecting stuff on Saturday nights probably than movie nights in the recent months. <laughs> I remember learning about Trypanosoma cruzi, the parasite that causes Chagas disease, and there's no cure. The treatments are extremely limited, and I remember thinking,